Hi guys, welcome to EV Zone. Today we will be comparing the Tesla Model Y with the Chevrolet Blazer. Make sure to stick till the end of this video as we have a lot to cover. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like today's video, it helps us a long way. A new era for the global auto industry may have begun with Tesla Inc's quick rise to become the most valuable car maker in the world. This era will be characterized by a Silicon Valley approach to software that will replace traditional manufacturing know-how. Analysts began to compare Tesla to Apple as it continued to develop novel manufacturing techniques, software designs, and electronic architecture that allow it to introduce innovations more quickly than competitors. A big round of applause to Tesla for manufacturing cars that are extremely fun to drive because of the instant throttle that an electrical engine brings. When Tesla first released Autopilot in October 2015, Musk cautioned drivers to be quite careful. After all, this was the first time that semi-autonomous technology of this level was being offered in a commercial vehicle. Musk acknowledged that some people may take their hands off the wheel regardless, adding, we do not advise that. Today, Tesla builds not only all-electric vehicles, but also infinitely scalable clean energy generation and storage products. Tesla believes the faster the world stops relying on fossil fuels and moves towards a zero-emission future, the better. Tesla is the leading player in the EV sector. The company's competitive benefits originate from its focus on environmental sustainability, its incorporation of technological inventions, product differentiation, and expenditure leadership along with other factors. With the help of worthy rivals like Volkswagen, Ford, and General Motors, who have spent decades creating some of the best automotive technology the world has ever seen, Tesla has managed to hold onto its position atop the hill. However, Tesla has also been able to outperform tech-savvy and savvy automotive startups that are exclusively focused on battery powertrains and are making inroads into the electric market. The two most well-known companies that fall under that category, Rivian and Lucid, have yet to surpass Tesla. Compared to the Audi Q4 e-tron with its folds and details, Tesla's design is less striking, but there is still something elegant about the simplicity it offers. Is Tesla Model Y worthy to buy? Why buy Tesla? Well, viewers, part of Tesla's charisma is that, well, it's a Tesla. Everyone knows that the brand has a huge stockpile, and for many people, it doesn't matter that it has many competitors. The Tesla Model Y is a vehicle you'll be drawn to if a Tesla is what you're after. The Tesla Model Y won the Best Luxury Electric SUV US News Award, besting a strong field of deserving battery-powered sport utility vehicles. Early in 2020, the Model Y was first delivered to owners and was the automaker's response to the hugely popular crossover SUV market. Tesla's cars received a new honor as shopping marketplace Cars.com said the electric vehicle maker topped its index of American-made cars for the second year in a row. Tesla's Model Y compact SUV made the top of the list, followed by its Model 3 compact sedan in the second spot. Tesla proclaimed that Model Y is on the way to being the world's highest-selling car by revenue this year, and it will presumably be the best-selling vehicle by total volume next year. Statistically, it's the world's best-selling electric car. Features of Tesla Model Y When the Tesla Model Y was announced, numerous experts assumed it was just a Model 3 with a different boot, presenting a hatchback-style opening rather than the saloon style on the smaller car. The drivers have an elevated advantage and they can see through traffic satisfactorily among all other SUVs, and it offers that big coupe styling with its dropped rear roofline. The Tesla Model Y's interior is largely identical to that of the Model 3. It adopts that simplistic style with uncomplicated panels and finishes free of buttons and controls. The interior offers two options. It is either light or dark, and whimsical details are kept to a minimum. That may entice some drivers' freedom from the lots of buttons and controllers that other cars offer, or may seem a little weird. There's a valid reason behind that. We have heard Elon Musk say multiple times that the car should be doing the driving, not the human, and that explains a lot of what you experience. The number of controls is reduced because the Model Y wants to do everything for you. The automobile wants it to be an automatic experience. The Tesla Model Y has dual motors for all-wheel drive and promises a range of up to 315 miles on a single charge. It's fitted with 19 wheels, a five-seat interior, and a full-length panoramic glass sunroof as standard. Electric front seats, heated front and rear seats, a heated steering wheel, a 14-speaker sound system, and two wireless smartphone charging pads are included in the package. Chevrolet Blazer EV The brand new 2024 Chevy Blazer EV joins the 2024 Chevy Silverado EV and 2024 Chevy Equinox EV as Chevrolet's third zero-emission vehicle built on Ultium battery architecture 
and Altium Drive technology. With the Blazer EV, the Bowtie brand aims to upend the zero emissions market and establish itself as a major player in the fast-growing EV market. The Blazer EV won't be a gas blazer with an EV propulsion system. Rather, it will be a brand new model within the Blazer family with a unique exterior and interior. Four trim levels will be available, with the mid-range 2LT and RS models going on sale first in summer 2023. Following soon after, sales of the highest specified SS trim will begin before the end of 2023. Beginning in early 2024, the 1LT trim will be the least expensive option. Chevrolet Blazer EV versus Tesla Model Y, how the electric SUVs compare. The Chevrolet, Blazer, and Tesla Model Y are amazing electric SUVs that offer a suite of compelling features. Here's how they compare. How do the Tesla Model Y and Chevrolet Blazer EV compare favorably against one another? Both are midsize SUVs that run entirely on electricity and have a ton of interesting features. Chevrolet's first attempt to create an electric vehicle is the Blazer EV, unlike the Tesla Model Y, which has been manufactured since 2020. Chevrolet plans to release the car as a 2024 model, indicating the company's desire to finally enter the EV market. In addition to the Blazer EV, an electric Silverado is planned for release in late 2023. This is the first time an EV has sported the well-known Silverado nameplate. If we observe both Ultratech automobiles closely, we come to the conclusion that the Blazer EV comes with more additional trim options for prospective customers as they can pick from the quartet of 1LT, 2LT, RS and the premium trim SS. In contrast, Tesla buyers are stuck choosing between either the long range or performance variants of the Model Y. Regarding price, the Chevrolet Blazer EV is the most affordable, with the base trim 1LT starting at $44,995. The Tesla Model Y's long range model retails for $67,990, though the figure touted on the website is $59,440 and takes into consideration potential savings. The potential savings incorporates motivations and the amount buyers would have paid on gas for six years. The range of the Model Y is greater than the range provided by the base trim of the Blazer EV. While the Model Y's long range lives up to its moniker and offers a whopping 318 miles, the 1LT offers up to 247 miles. However, when the upper trim of the Blazer EV is compared with the Model Y, the range competition becomes more fascinating. The Model Y's range of 318 miles is a bit overpowered by the RS's range of up to 320 miles. Due to their greater top speed and acceleration, both premium trims have a smaller range. The Model Y's performance trim is capable of being driven for around 303 miles. The Chevrolet Blazer EV's SS trim maxes out at 290 miles, a few miles short of the Tesla. The Model Y features a 15-inch touchscreen, a few inches more than the Blazer EV's 11 inches, which let drivers get the latest features and advancements to the EV's functionality. The Blazer EV comes with a distinctive hands-free start system where drivers don't need to use keys to start the EV. All drivers need to do is enter the vehicle using their key fob and tap the brake for the Blazer EV to instantly come alive. The Model Y was not designed to support Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, whereas the Blazer EV does. A Tesla Android update has discovered a workaround though. Given that the automaker is always focused on creating battery-powered vehicles, Tesla is the undisputed winner in terms of experience. Well guys, hope we were able to draw a concise comparison between both EVs romping the tracks Although it is too early to predict which brand would rule the market, you must keep in mind that Elon Musk has often declared that he will revolutionize EVs and Tesla would surprise the world. Regarding experience, Tesla is the unmistakable champion since the automaker has always been in the business of developing vehicles that run on batteries. Although the Chevrolet Blazer EV is a newcomer to the scene, the vehicle employs General Motors' fascinating battery technology program called Ultium. All GM EVs, subsidiaries included, will be built on this platform and support level 2 and DC fast charging. Please leave a comment down below your own thoughts and don't forget to like today's video. And subscribe to the channel if you want to be updated to everything EV. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.